Okay, I'm gonna try it again. So if I select, let's say this is the Africa monthly uh, data set, that's my default right now, okay? But I come here and I, instead of the monthly, I want the IRE decade. It is already selected as yes, because I had it as yes before. So in order to select it as yes again, I have to turn it on, turn, turn it no, then turn it back to yes, and then save. Okay, so now I should have the IRE decade instead of the, of the monthly that I had before. So let's close this. If I open any tools, so it keeps the monthly that I had, but I, I wanted the IRA decade, okay? So now if I come here and if I open any tools, so let's see this one. Yeah, so it keeps the monthly as the default. Okay, so now let's do this. Now let's since I want the IRE decade, I'm going to turn the monthly to no. Okay. And uh, let's see, what do I have now? So now, this is the Africa Decadal. This one is probably yes. So now this one is yes. So I have to turn this one to no also and uh, let's see what else I have yes I think that's it so this one is now global decade let's turn this one to no save so and this one is yes so now it has to be the one I want so now that I, everything else is no the IRE Decad is yes, right? That's that's what we want. So once I do that, then it worked, and great. So now let's now let's say I'm gonna work with something else. I, I'm going to select and make the global decad um, the default. So now the global decad is is the default and he remember it right that's great beautiful let's uh let's do something else i want now the africa decade to be the default let's close it doesn't have data but the, now the africa decade is the default great if i turn the program off and uh, and restart it so I just restarted the program. So now let's um, bring this up again. So E remember the Africa Decadal, right? Great. But let's say that I wanna go back and do my work in Ethiopia and I want to get the IRE decade as the default. Save it. it went back to the error of remembering only the Africa decade. So then I have to go back and turn everything else to no, so in order to keep the one that I want. So the, the problem that I see is that it keeps many yes. So if, it, if once I select, uh, a single one to yes, all the others in the same data type. Because uh, I mean, right now I just I just moved between rainfall data sets, so they were all the same data type. So once I select one to yes, everything else in the same data type should go back to no. Uh, that's what I noticed. That uh, if one, once I do that, then it works.